Hey, welcome to day one of seven days of victory. I'm so glad to be doing this journey with you. So day number one, our scripture verse is found in 2 Corinthians chapter 5 and verse 17. And it reads like this. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has passed away and behold, the new has come. Now, just a moment, we're going to do the declaration for today, but I want to remind you of this. You are new. You are a new creation. If you believe in Jesus, you are now a child of God. And here's what's amazing to me is we as children of God have the ability to raise the dead. That's right. Jesus told us in his word that he has given us all authority under heaven and under the earth, uh, in heaven, all authority has been given to us. And what's amazing to me is how many believers use their ability and the authority and power given to them to raise the dead, not to see the supernatural things of God manifest in life, but to see them raise their past, hello, to life. I, have, I can't tell you how many believers I've encountered that have used this authority and power from heaven not to create the world that they want, but to bring their past to life. Let me tell you, God does not want you to live in your past. God wants you to live in the here and the now because he has great things in store for your future. You have a destiny. You have a purpose. So stop living in the past and start living in the now and see God manifest in your future. So let's declare this together. You have the PDF there in front of you, but let's declare this together. And if you need to say this, I can say it for you, but you need to learn to say this over your life. Say, I declare that today is a day of new beginnings. The past is over and the new has come in the name of Jesus. Friend, I want you to be blessed today and know this. Your past is over and the new has come. Seven days of victory. Day number one down. Let's go. See you tomorrow.